They stole her discovery and gave her Nobel Prize to a man who betrayed her. Lise Meitner, the woman who unlocked the secret of the atom, was written out of history by the very people who once praised her brilliance. She gave the world the key to nuclear fission and then watched that key turn into a weapon of mass destruction. Born in 1878 in Vienna, she was told science was no place for women. She studied anyway, in basements, in secret, forbidden to even set foot in universities. But her mind burned brighter than their laws. She became one of the first female physicists in the world, a Jewish woman in an empire that would soon devour its own. In Berlin, she worked with Otto Hahn for decades, side by side, discovering how to split the atom, to break matter itself. But when Hitler rose, she was forced to flee Germany overnight, leaving her lab, her notes, her life behind. Months later, from exile in Sweden, she deciphered the data Han sent her, the impossible reaction he couldn't explain. Lisa saw what he didn't, nuclear fission, the birth of atomic energy, the most powerful discovery in human history. Born from the mind of a woman the world refused to see, but the Nobel Committee saw only men. Otto Hahn took the prize. Lisa got nothing but silence, yet she never claimed vengeance. When her discovery was used to make the atomic bomb, she refused to help. Science, as she said, should bring light, not death. She died unrecognized but undefeated. Today, her name lives among the stars, literally. Element 109, Mitnarium, bears her name. She didn't just split the atom, she split open the boundaries of gender, power, and history itself. This is Chronicles of Spirit.